is the first rain of the season and it is so cozy and it finally feels like autumn is here and it has me so excited so for today's video it's going to be a very cozy autumnal vlog um, doing all of the fun autumn things to celebrate the first cozy day of the season so um, some of the things are going to be like reading, uh, maybe baking something autumnal, um, decorating our trailer for fall, so many cozy things. And my friend Morgan, Morgan Long, um, she is doing a autumnal readathon with her Patreons and so she created this very cozy and fun checklist to do alongside of it. And so I thought it would be fun to um, do some of these things throughout the day today. Um, some of them are like wake up early, go for a walk and collect treasures, read an autumnal book, write down a beautiful quote, light a cozy candle, wear warm knitted socks, enjoy a steaming cup of tea, bake an autumnal treat. So many cozy things. So I'm going to be following this along for part of the day. And, um, of course, we'll be taking you along with all of the cozy things I will be doing. Um, one thing I did want to share is that, I think I've mentioned it before, but 
I've been trying to motivate and inspire myself to read more. And with my new job, I actually have a lot more time to read while I'm there since the um, child that I nanny is uh, less than a year old, so she does nap quite a bit. So I have some free time to read. And so I have quite the stack of books that I hope to read by the end of the year, basically. Um, so throughout the autumn season and then the beginning of winter. Um, but I was gonna show the books that I've already read so far. Um, I've already read five books this month. Um, I've read Mistborn, The Final Empire, A Wolf for a Spell, The Golden Day, The Language of Spells, and The Animals of Farthingwood, The Adventure Begins. Um, I enjoyed almost all of these. The book I was reading this morning was finishing up um, this one, The Animals of Farthingwood, and it was a bit depressing. <laughs> so I'm hoping to start another book today to raise my spirits um, and get me more into the autumn mood. But um, I'm excited to be reading so much and to continue reading, and I think tomorrow I might uh, film somewhat of like a readathon or an autumnal read with me and see how many books I can read um, in one day tomorrow. So, so many fun things happening this weekend and I can't wait to take you along with me. Um, so first, what I think I'm going to do is, I also need to run um, to Target to pick up a couple of things. One, we're going to get um, Kiki's Delivery Service, which is the movie Jake and I are going to watch tonight, so I want to be able to pick that up and maybe a couple of other things. Um, so I think I'm going to do that first and then decorate the trailer and then maybe make a autumnal treat. So um, why don't we go run to the store and pick up a couple of things. Well, that outing was a bust. Um, it said that Kiki's Delivery Service was in stock at the Target that's near us, and it was in fact not in stock. So we checked a couple other places, and no one has it. Um, but we have one last option. Um, it might be on HBO Max or something like that to be able to watch for free, so we'll see if we have access to that this evening, so hopefully we'll still be able to watch it, but um, we may need to pick another movie, but we'll see. Um, but I am starving, I'm gonna make some lunch, and then I'm going to decorate the trailer. So I'm very excited about that. Um, but let's go heat up a bowl of soup. <laughs>
home is so nice and cozy now that it is decorated for fall. I absolutely love everything um, and I hope you liked it and found maybe some inspiration for your own house for the autumn season. Um, now that that's done, I think I am ready to go for a walk. That is one of the things on the list of, that is on the autumn checklist um, that Morgan created. So I think I'm going to drive to this park that's about five minutes away and um, bring a little basket and collect some treasures along the way. So uh, let's go find some autumnal treasures, friends. <laughs>
we um, went on a very lovely walk and I found lots of autumnal treasures to bring home. Um, then I decided to do a little bit of reading as another item on the checklist is to read an autumnal book. So I've already read this book before, but I've been really wanting to reread it. Uh, Snow and Rose by Emily Winfield Martin. Uh, she wrote and illustrated it, and it is a beyond beautiful book, both um, with the written word as well as her art. It's very inspiring, it's very autumnal, um, and it put me in such a cozy mood reading that story and getting a couple chapters in. Um, but then I got super hungry and Jake and I decided to make some dinner. We made some Impossible Burgers and made our own french fries. It was absolutely delicious. <laughs> Such a good dinner. Um, but now I think I'm going to bake an autumnal treat as that is another item on the checklist that I really want to do. So I think I'm going to make some pumpkin oatmeal cookies. Um, I saw a video by Jennifer Garner. She's an actress, but she makes these really funny cooking videos on her Instagram. And she recently made these cookies and they looked delicious. So I want to try to make those. And then Jake and I are going to watch, um, hopefully, Kiki's Delivery Service if we can find it on this certain subscription. So that is the plan. Let's get to baking. <laughs> 